The two mirror impression technique can be used for any impression, but it is particularly helpful when one needs to capture the vestibular roll, as for a complete denture, or removable partial denture. The goal is improved visibility. The operator holds one mirror, an assistant holds the second. The mirrors are placed to retract the lip far enough anteriorly that you can just see all of the anterior vestibule and the posterior vestibule at the same time. Do not place the mirror so far anteriorly that the cheeks obscure the posterior vestibule. Again, the goal is to see all of the vestibule at once. The patient should be instructed to relax their cheeks and lips. Retract the lip so that the, neither the tray nor the impression material contact the lips during insertion. Seat the anterior portion of the tray first, aligning it with the labial frenum, and then rotate the back of the tray into place with the mirror still in position. Do not remove either mirror until you see a slight excess of impression material come up and over the border of the tray, around the entire periphery and the posterior border of the tray. You should see a slight excess along the entire posterior border of the tray. If there is an area without excess, continue to seat the tray until you see such excess. Next, use a cotton tip applicator to remove this posterior excess to improve patient comfort. Then lightly border mold and stabilize the tray without excess pressure until the impression material is fully set. You will find that this technique can dramatically reduce the number of voids and bubbles on your removable prosthodontic impressions. Just a little pull your lip down again like a little flat.